About 700 million years ago, two galaxies collide with each other. This was happening a long time ago, but the light recently reached the Hubble. It took 700 million years for it to get to us. But I don't want to talk about this picture, because it's not weird enough for this video. We're looking for stranger things. Everybody knows that space is very different from where we're living at. Like the core of Earth is 5200 degrees Celsius. But the core of our star is 15 million degrees Celsius. You guys realize these temperatures, but these are not real temperatures. We want to go somewhere that has an unbelievable temperature. Ultra Hot Star Factory ARP220. A place where two galaxies are colliding with each other. But not right now, 700 million years ago. This is ARP220, and it is known as the hottest place in the universe. A temperature that's 20 million times the temperature of the core of our sun. And that's around 300 trillion degrees centigrade. Or 300 with 12 zeros in front of it. Nobody went and put a thermometer to see the temperature, but from the light it shines and the distance we're looking at it, you could tell what kind of a hellhole it is. Hubble has a lot of cool photos. Another cool photo is this one. This picture is called the Boomerang Nebula. This is the opposite of the hell we just seen. The average temperature in space is about negative 270 Celsius. It's extremely cold, right? But do you know what's the temperature of the Boomerang Nebula? Negative 272 degrees Celsius. So it's only 2 degrees colder than the average temperature of space. And the main reason that it's this cold is because it produces gas and stops heat from entering the area. And that is why it has this type of temperature. The gas also stops microwaves from entering. So if the microwaves can't even get in, it's gonna be that cold for a long time. And it is still believed that this is the coldest spot in the universe. So this was the coldest and hottest place in the world. What are some other weird things the Hubble has seen? Another cool one is the Red Rectangle Nebula. Astronomers believe the weird part about this is how exact and perfect it is. You usually do not see a nebula be this perfect, but this one is a perfect triangle and rectangle. Some scientists believe what caused this were different shock waves. They believe different explosions caused this perfect nebula to be formed. But let's go look at another cool nebula, NGC 3324. A nebula that looks like a person, specifically Putin. This picture is old, but after the Ukraine war, people have shown this on the media. But before that, we're seeing the coolest pictures the Hubble took, so we can get ready for the insane photos that James Webb is going to give us. Another cool thing that the Hubble has seen is two galaxies called the M81 and M82. These two are acting very weird. The way we see it, it seems like they're chasing each other. M82 is weird itself. Hubble shows like the M81 has been shot and from its middle is gushing out blood but they believe it's gas that's coming out that looks like that. But they really can't understand why that much gas is exiting a galaxy that size. 
Just like we said, M82 is chasing M81 and they're getting closer and closer because M81 is a little bit faster and eventually they will collide with each other. But unfortunately, we can't see it because they need 600 more million years to reach each other and it will take over 1 billion years to complete the collision. Another very interesting photo is this Stefan Quentin. In this photo, you see five different galaxies that are different sizes and they look like they're right next to each other. But this is not the case. The picture does look like they're right next to each other, but in reality, they're millions of light years away from each other. But the way the Hubble photo is taken makes it look like they're right next to each other about to hit each other. For the next photo, let's go to 45 million light years away and look at two galaxies, NGC 4038 and NGC 4039 and they're mid-collision right now. These two are in the middle of mixing with each other. This is our future as well, because eventually the Milky Way and Andromeda galaxy will collide with each other. The next interesting photo we're gonna look at is the Black Eye Galaxy. Astronomers believe that the black eye galaxies is formed with two galaxies that hit each other about 1 million years ago. And the reason they call it the black eye is that it has an eyeliner around it. So we're talking about these long distances like we have a chance of visiting that in our lifetime. We're stuck on moon and Mars. We can't even imagine farther than that right now. If we want to look at weird stuff, there's a bunch of places on Earth that we haven't seen and we really don't know much about them. Like the Eye of the Sahara, which is located in Mauritania. Or the Lut Desert in Iran. Antarctica, the biggest desert in the world and it's also the coldest place in the world. The Mariana Trench and we have no idea what's going on down there or under the Antarctic ice. What I'm trying to say is that space is very far away. We should appreciate the place we're at and go see it for ourselves. There's so many places on Earth we can discover and enjoy. Like another weird spot I know about is this comment section. Please go to the comment section, see other people's comments, and learn a little bit more about the world. 